Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Tracy and if you don't know me, I have a passion for upcycling clothing and I teach sewing on here. For the past month, I have been working on the made to order dresses and I finally dropped them off at the post office this morning. I've completed them. Um, I just got back from the gym, so I wanted to answer the biggest question I get all the time is where I purchase my silk. I purchase my silk from Kalamo Silk. They operate and run their own factory. I love that they reuse their water, so um, through their filtration system, they're able to preserve a little bit of the environment, which is always great. Um, and I just I love the amount of colors they have. I purchased Silk Charmeau specifically for my silk dresses. But today is December 3rd. Um, I leave for California on Monday. I bought uh their silk charmeuse in 3102 it's the pfp silk short for prepared for printing which is what i'm going to use for the eco printing tutorial that i have planned just haven't had the time so um when i get to california i'm definitely going to give you guys a tutorial on that i hope you guys enjoy this vlog Cutting out all of these silk dresses was probably the like longest part. Um, I hate cutting fabric, especially on my floor. I just need like a bigger studio. I just like don't have enough space to cut out these big pieces of fabric. I have my machine set up for the olive dresses because I have, I have three olive dresses. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start prepping all of the pieces. I need to overlock them first before I actually start sewing them together. I also just like posted um, my TikTok video of like Shein stealing my silk lace cami design. I know my sewing pattern, like the back of my hand. I know that they are using my sewing patterns. My sewing patterns are for personal use only, not for commercial purposes. So it's kind of upsetting to see them do this. Um, but then again, it's nothing new. They do it to a lot of small designers. Thank you guys so much for all of the support. So let's go ahead and just get back to the silk dresses. I got where I wanted to with the olive dresses already. They're almost done. I have them pretty much sewn together. I just have to attach the back panels for the olive dresses. Since my TikTok went pretty viral for um, Shein stealing my design, I woke up this morning and Shein has taken down that item. So that was really exciting to wake up to. I'm so glad that they took it down. By them taking it down, it does show that they are 
in the wrong and they know they copied my design i'm just so happy for all of the support i got from you guys i'm gonna go ahead and just finish prepping and sewing most of the purple dress Good morning you guys. So last night I got to where I wanted on the purple dress. She's pretty much almost sewn together. I have to touch the back panels but the back skirt and the front skirt and the under bust is all sewn together as well as these straps. And she also asked for a modest panel in the back because it might be a little bit too low for her. Today my plan is to sew all of the back panels. Um, that's what I'm currently working on so I still need to do the olive dresses and then hopefully get to the purple one. I'm just going to go ahead and finish that. Good morning you guys so i'm headed to the gym but last night i was able to finish all of the back panels on all the olive dresses and the purple one so today my plan is to start sewing the black dress and putting it together but i'm gonna go to the gym first and then i'm gonna come back and just start sewing It's Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Last night I finished prepping most of the black silk dress and I was working on the centerpiece for our Thanksgiving dinner. This is the first time I've ever made a centerpiece and I think it turned out so cute. Putting a vase with a candle in the middle so it's gonna look so cute on the table. Um, but I'm just pretty much taking a break today. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, you guys. I hope you all had a wonderful Thanksgiving. I need to go ahead and actually sew the black dress together because I was only able to prep like the black pieces. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and finish sewing that dress.
finally Monday. I took a break over the weekend. I just have to go to the garment district and then when I come back, I'm just planning to start hemming all of the dresses and um, it's probably gonna take me about like two or three days to finish all the hemming. And I also have to like hand baste all the hems down because Silk just loves to move around. So it's a lot of hand basting this week and hand sewing the straps together. I'm just gonna go ahead and head to the garment district and start hemming these dresses right when I get back. Hey guys, so yesterday I finished hemming all of the dresses. I'm just gonna put in the grommets today, that is the plan. Um, and then all I have to do is attach that modest panel to the purple dress. I'm gonna hand sew in some snaps. I just got ready for a podcast interview. I'm going to be on Samira's podcast, The Environmentalist, so I will like link it right here. She's interviewing me about the whole situation with Shein stealing my design. Can't wait for you guys to listen to that. I'm just gonna go ahead and finish these dresses so I can start packing them.